Greetings. Allow me to first introduce myself. I am Shakil Akcha from the Science Education Department of the Mauritius Institute of Education, which is the only tertiary education institution in the country, having the mandate of teacher education, curriculum development, and educational research. I am also a member of the Human Welfare League, which is an Islamic association based in Mauritius with a social endeavor. The title of my presentation is investigating the correlation between religion and key human values among educational stakeholders in Mauritius. So let's start with the introduction. In fact, it is undeniable that human values are key in shaping the youth into responsible citizens, first, capable of making a positive difference in the lives of others. Second, capable of projecting himself as a model to others. And third, capable of facing global, national, and personal challenges. In fact, according to Cornel Royal 2021, religion plays an important role in the development of such human values, and eventually, and moral and ideal behavior. It is in this perspective that this study has been developed to investigate the correlation between religion and key human values among educational stakeholders in Mauritius. It is important to have an overview of the literature review to situate the context of this study. Analysis of the literature revealed that several studies have been done in this field to correlate religion and human values. For instance, Carnero et al. in 2021 studied human values and religion using evidence from the European Social Survey. Ives and Kidwell in 2019 studied religion and social values. In fact, there are several such research and studies have been, which have been done. However, Detailed analysis of the scholarship revealed that, first, most of the studies are limited to very few human values. Second, there is no published article showcasing the correlation of religion to human values in the Mauritian context. Third, an Islamic perspective has not yet been adopted in analyzing the correlations. And fourth, most of the available publication are limited to simple statistical analysis. So how, this, how is this study different? This study has three main research questions. The first one, is there any significant correlation between religion and key human values in Mauritius? Second, is there a significant difference in key human values between religious groups in Mauritius? Referring to religious, religious groups, we have mainly Hindus, Christians, and Muslim communities in Mauritius. Third, what are the levels of likelihood of the key human values in the Muslim community of Mauritius? So let's explore the methodology used. In fact, the Mauritius specific data from EIMS mapping the terrains project was used to investigate the correlation between religion and a broad set of human values, namely forgiveness, individualistic orientation, collectivistic orientation, self-efficacy, problem solving, meaning making, sense of belongingness, religiosity and spirituality, hope, life satisfaction, gratitude, emotion, empathy, and self-regulation. Actually, a purely quantitative methodology was used, where data from EAMS Mapping the Terrains project were analyzed using SPSS and AMOS software to first have an overview of the descriptive analysis to showcase the association between the main religious beliefs in Mauritius and the key human values. And second part of the research work is about the designing and development of a structural equation model, that is the SEM, which showcases the existing correlation between religion and the set of human values. With this, let's move to the next part, which is the findings. 
Let us start with the distribution of respondents. 971 participants, representative of the different educational stakeholders in Mauritius, participated in this survey. The stakeholders included school students, university students, school teachers, and university instructors. In fact, the sample was also representative in terms of gender, age group, educational level, and religion, to include the different groups, religious groups, that is Muslims, Christians, Hindus, and others. Others represent the less populated religious religions in Mauritius, including Jewish, Buddhist, and atheist. Actually, more details of the distribution of the Mauritian respondent in the EAMS Mapping the Terrain survey is available in the raw data. However, you can have an analysis of the respondent in an upcoming paper from Bell, Hossein Ali, and Acha. Let's move to the structural equation model produced using AMOS software. This model shows higher correlation between religion and human values such as, first one, collectivistic orientation in terms of cooperation, relationship, family re relationship, parent-children relationship, respect of group decisions, and team spirit. The second human value, which is highly correlated in, with religion in Mauritius, is empathy in relation to different perspectives, empathy towards other sides, empathy in relation to upset, criticism, waste, and difficulties. Third, religion has been correlated to spirituality in terms of prayer, belief in God, respect of other religious groups, and self-religiosity. Fourth, Religion has been correlated with life satisfaction in relation to life ideals, life excellence, satisfaction of important things in life, and change. The fifth human values correlated with religion in Mauritius is hope in relation to anxiety, to anxiety fulfillment, hopefulness, life quality, and difficulties. Sixth one is problem solving, including identification of options, collection of data, expression of ideas, planning of actions, finding solutions, among others. Last but not least, religion has been correlated with the human value self-regulation in Mauritius in terms of goal plans, resolution, progress, difficulties, willpower, distractions, decision-making, change, and focus. Further analysis of the existing correlation within groups, as shown in this table, revealed that there is significant differences between the means of Muslims, Christians, Hindus, and others in relation to key human values such as collectivistic orientation, problem solving, meaning making, spirituality, hope, and life satisfaction. This table is, very, is a very important one as it shows the mean values and standard deviation related to religion. Analysis of the table revealed that all mean values are greater than two indicating that respondents of all religions in Mauritius have high likelihood for all the construct that is human values. However, when comparing the means, it was observed that the Muslim community of Mauritius have greater likelihood and are more agreeable towards most of the values and competencies as compared to the other communities. For instance, Greater mean values are noted for, mis for Muslim community for most values. In fact, 10 out of 15, including collective orientation, 
mean making, sense of belonging, spirituality, teacher self-efficacy, hope gratitude, emotion regulation, empathy, and self-regulation. However, it is noted that Christians show higher level of forgiveness and life satisfaction as compared to others. And Hindus show higher level of individualistic orientation, self-efficacy, and problem solving as compared to others. This brings us to the conclusion. In fact, the output of this study, which mapped the different human values to the main religious beliefs present in the Mauritian community represent important baseline data that inform policymakers and other educational stakeholders on the way forward to further the development of human values among our students. Second, the finding revealed that Muslim community in Mauritius have greater likelihood and are more agreeable towards most of the values, 10 out of 15, excluding forgiveness, life satisfaction, individualistic orientation, self-efficacy, and problem solving. Therefore, those values should be the target of training in the future. The article, which is going to be published after this presentation, provides a set of recommendations that inform policymakers and other educational specialists on the way forward to enhance the development of human values among the educational population. This will provide healthy, values-based multicultural and multi-ethnic relationships between the different ethnic groups of Mauritius. With this, thank you very much.